Hello, I'm Nadia McLeod from RPM Re Legal Kits, and we help you cut your legal costs with our online template kits. The 20th of October is World Conflict Resolution Day. With this in mind, we wanted to take some time to discuss how using mediation can help resolve family law disputes. Mediation is an effective alternative to formal legal proceedings if you and your partner cannot reach a mutual agreement. Couples can use mediation to divide property, finances, superannuation and other assets. You can also use it to discuss financial child support and custody arrangements. Those who use mediation often find it easier to be open and communicative and leave feeling positive about the outcome. A court often orders mediation for couples to attempt to resolve a dispute without a full hearing. These are run by an appointed third party who can moderate the meeting and help create a legally binding document, outlining the terms of the agreement. By having a moderator, both parties are given a chance to speak freely and honestly about their preferences. Voluntary mediation can save you money and stress. If you eventually end up in court, attempting formal mediation shows there have been efforts to come to an agreement. Formal moderators perform assessments and can advise if they think it would be better for your dispute to be heard by a court. This can occur because of the complexity of the dispute or safety concerns for one or more parties involved. Mediation is far less expensive, time-consuming and stressful than court appearances. Mediation allows you to bring up things you may not be able to in formal proceedings. Court cases are also public appearances. You can better maintain privacy by having a closed mediation. To ensure the mediation results are legally binding, use a formal financial agreement. Creating an agreement requires both parties to seek independent legal advice and for it to be witnessed by an impartial third party. Moderators can often help you devise an agreement but do not replace the legal advice you both must receive under the Family Law Act. Financial agreements are helpful even when there is no dispute. Future disputes can be efficiently resolved when an agreement is already in place. Many lawyers recommend creating financial agreements before the breakdown of relationships. This can help you be open with your partner about your financial goals and values. To help make agreements easier, RPMRE has created professionally drafted templates, which you can access by following the links below. We also provide legal review packages that arrange the independent legal advice both parties need to receive and ensure your agreements are binding by law. For further information about family law mediation, check out our link to the article below. And if you want to solve simple legal problems, cut costs and take control of everyday issues, please subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button.